Hey howdy guys, how are we doing? We are back for another video of 7 Days to Die Alpha 18. It is Horde Night, here we go, day 28. Um, we have got about um, a minute 20 game minute stage ready to go, so uh, before we get ready to go, sorry, before we get underway here, so got a little bit of time. Um, pretty much what I am looking at is I've got all of this ammo um, for both my pistol, machine gun, and I do have some shotgun rounds for the double barrel there, so Hopefully, um, look, fingers crossed that we will be fine. I've got some food, got some bandages. I think we should be okay. Took one little herbal antibiotics there just in case if I get infected throughout the night, but I don't think that's going to be a problem anyway. So, yeah, I think we should be right. Um, so let's get over to the Horde base. Uh, just before we get started there, I will have to pump up the Gamma. So, look, apologies on that one there in advance. Um, so let's just go ahead and whoop, let's just go back to default um, So I might have to just say put it up to 120. It's not going to be Aesthetically pleasing, but look that's all I've got to work with right now. So um, let's get over there and we'll um, Get ourselves measured up here and to be honest, I think I ran out of time with the whole um, Spikes on the ground there. So I'm gonna see how I go without the spikes it should be okay because there's a clear line of sight, a clear pathway for them to run in and um, try to kill me basically. So I should be okay without them, but I may introduce them um, as the night Horde Knights get a little bit more crazy, but we'll see how we go. All right, so let's um, just open up this and that for now. I did turn down the audio for this as well, so hopefully it won't be too bad as I'm sort of talking over the video here. So I'm hoping that the audio levels will be fine for this video. So we'll see how we go. And basically if all goes um, pear shape here, I'll be able to jump out of here and run right across to my original horde base, which I sort of spruced up a little bit as well. So that should be fine. Um, yeah, so I don't think we'll have much of a problem going um, heading into this horde night here just want to make sure that we have um, everything um, uh, loaded and ready to go I did bring the SMG just in case um, just in case if I needed it uh, for you know those short fire sp um, bursts of um, shooting um, double barrel should be alright I got over 300 rounds I really want to find a pump shotgun I think that's something that I really want to find um, and I'm hoping when I do the the next video um, I might find one in that uh, video there, but we'll see how we go. Um, and then, as you can see, I've got over nearly 900 rounds of the 7.6 there, so hopefully that should carry me through. We'll see how we go with that. And obviously the pistol that shares um, the ammo with the SMG, I've got about 1,045. So I don't have any other ammo that I can sort of craft and get um, and get things ready underway. So it is a bit of an annoyance. So it's pretty much everything that I've got there. And as I sort of look into here, that's all I've got. So no H, um, uh, hollow points or armor piercing for any of them. And the same rules apply for the shotgun. So yeah, um, we'll see how we go. So we're about 30 minutes away um, getting into this here. And as you can see, I've got quite a few of these hatches here ready to go to sort of help me out here. Um, I'm going to leave this one up here for now. And then once this breaks through, which I'm sort of intending for this to break through, um, it'll be pretty much all right. So once these guys sort of run in, they'll be able to sort of have... Um, well, there'll be a few zombies in here. They're not sort of, you know, falling out of the front of the base here. So as we sort of... Look at it here, there's only a limited amount of space here as they're sort of trying to clamber in. So basically, they're pretty much going to come on the sides and everything like that. They may, may even jump off and what I'm hopeful that they do is they're just going to run back up and then try to um, make their way in as I'm sort of um, um, laying down on them with the, um, uh, with the guns here. And then what I've got up here is I've put some of these... Um, uh, I even forgot what these blocks are called, but I think they're these short blocks. But anyway... Um, and I've also got the iron bars up here. So if there's any birds up here, I can actually see what's going on. And then I can just sort of shoot accordingly if I need to. And which I probably would presume that that's probably going to happen. So yeah, hopefully this would be, um, hopefully this would be all right. But um, it's pretty simple. It's a simple base. Um, like I said, I think this won't be sustainable for a full horde. Even if this sort of falls over in a sense here, depending on what the nature of the situation is, of course, um, 
I should be able to go sort of, you know, mid to three quarters of the way through and then just sort of jump back into here. And this would probably serve as a, you know, um, quarter to half Horde Knight type of base. But anyway, I digress with that. I'm just hopeful that this will work. I'm thinking of another idea for another Horde base as well, just to sort of see how we go with things. I'm just sort of trying things out as well, especially, you know, my first Let's Play. Um, this is all basically trial and error for me. So, yeah, pretty much that's what we're looking at. So let's open up this and open up this and um, let's go ahead and yep yeah, start off with this. Ooh, should have done that. Oops. No. Man, if I didn't do that, uh, yep, yeah, that would have been a horrific situation. But anyway, here we go. I can't hear them. I can see them. There's a spider zombie over there, as you can see. I'm just hoping they, they, they all come running up. There we go, first customer of the evening. Hello. Hey, guys. And we've got a spider zombie here. So, what I haven't done is I haven't actually um, increased the the wave of zombies. So, this should be set as a pre -salt, uh, sorry, preset default. And hopefully, I mean, even having said that, um, I should be okay. There would be a, a lot of zombies anyway, regardless of the fact. But right now, um, I think we should be okay as it is. And I don't know what... Actually, there's a few of these spider zombies here, so... I'm not too sure why I'm not getting through. There we go. I think we're fine with them. Oh no, they're still there. <laughs> sort of counterproductive. You're sort of um, shooting at the actual hatch and... Anyway, okay, Oop. and as soon as that breaks, I should be able to just walk back one step, or a couple steps I should say, and pretty much I'll be able to sort of um, open up the next hatch and just have that buffer as I sort of go along here. But so far, so good. Oops, um, he's still there. Come on, mate. There we go. Come on, come on. Okay, well, was that a white? Oh no, I thought that was a white for a second. I thought I had whites already. Wow. No, but that's okay. Actually, what I might do is I might just elevate the gamma just a little bit more. I really don't want a bad video for you guys. I mean, it looks fine on my screen, but when you guys are watching it on uh, YouTube there, they do predominantly darken a lot of things, which is really annoying. So um, I might try and brighten them up as I sort of go along. Oh, ooh, there's a cop. We go, turn around for one second, and <laughs> you see a cop sort of show up here. So so far, it's actually not bad. I mean, it's it's nothing nothing too crazy at this stage. I'm just sort of chilling here, just you know, doing my thing. Um, this is the annoying part here. Okay, let's see if I can. Can I hit you? There we go. Oop, there's a cop before he spits and, and does anything on me. Better be safe than sorry here. I'm actually worried about um, on the floor there, so I don't know what's going on down on the floor there. I'm hoping that they're not killing the pylons there. I'll be really, really annoyed if they do, because if this thing breaks, I'll be in all sorts of trouble. Um, and then, yeah, I would have to jump through, but, um, through to my next base, wouldn't I? Come on, guys. Make your way through. I know there's a lot of decaying bodies here. Yes, I get that. But if you guys can just sort of, you know, toss them aside or even do me solid and actually throw them out, that'd be great. And then that way you guys can walk through and I can just sort of mow you down. Why not? <laughs> so. Oop. Bit of a reload. Um, yeah, so look. I think this is really, really manageable at the moment. I'm, I'm really not too worried at this stage. I'm just hoping the supports are okay. That's my, my, that's my biggest concern. Not so much what I'm doing with up here. Because these guys are coming in, you know, single firely, And I'm really not, you know, really not too bothered by them right now. Things even sort of get a bit close up and personal here. And, hello. And just continue to sort of wail on them. 
to be honest. I don't know if there's any... Oh, there is some birds out there. So let's um, let's go put that up. So this is what I'm saying before. We've got birds here. And at least I can sort of focus on them. Even though that they're sh um, breaking down the uh, those hatches, the, the old zombies there. I think it's too far away for me to actually clip him. I don't know why I'm spending too much time on this. I shouldn't have to be, but anyway. Anyway, let's just return back and just um, take these guys out. There's actually a few of these birds out here, so I think that, that might have some sort of hindrance as to why there's not a lot of these zombies coming through, because th these are part of the wave. Uh, what if happens if I grab the M60? There we go. Just sort of... Come on. Well, there we go. Well, I've got him falling down. Anyway, let's just use this for a little bit and see how we go with it. There we go. Take out that little spider zombie here. Oop. Let's quickly reload. Well, this is going to break anytime soon, so I'm not going to be too particularly worried about it, like I said before. But hopefully that encourages more to come in and I'll have more of a, um, uh, what do you call it? M more of a horde of zombies in here. Oh, okay. Yeah, alright. You just, um, you got the shakes there, buddy. You got the, the copper over here. Alright, I'm just going to quickly have a bit of a squeeze out here. I didn't actually close this door, which I should have done that in the first place. Okay, let's load up on this. Oop, okay, well that didn't happen. Anyway, load up. They're okay out there for the moment. I just want to see if there's any birds out here. If you can come down for me, that'd be fantastic so I can actually shoot you. But you look like a massive bird. And it's taking you a bit to actually shoot down. Okay, come on. Come on, there we go, perfect, okay. So that's all the birds. All right, ooh, jeez, okay, so they broke down to to the next stage here, so, all right, cool, cool, cool. The cop must have spat, spat or done something, I'm not too sure. That's okay, that's cool. Ooh, loot bag. Okay, well, ooh, let's just take that while we had it there. Okay, cool, so I did let him sort of, um, uh, ooh, here we go. And I need to repair this guy. Okay. Okay, and let's just switch over to this. And let's just take out some of the guys that we <laughs> that are coming through here. So far, so good. Like I said, I expect at least, you know, at least two hatches were to, um, you know, to come crashing down. So that is not a problem. As I said, I think I've got the ammo for this too, so I'm not even worried about it. I might even just switch to the shotgun, just have some fun. Why not? There we go, there's a couple of them. These, these guys are respawning. Ooh, you, would, you dropped something. I heard you. You too. And... Oops, we've got a cop here. Did I actually kill him in one shot? That's amazing. Oh, here comes another one. Oh, he's got a spit. He's got a spit. He just spat at you, pain. Come on. Double shot. And... Come on, guys. Alright. I think something just needs a little bit more consistency in here, so let's just continue to mow them down. You keep um, crowd surfing that little um, that little loot bag there. I'm I'm really wanting to get that. Hopefully soon. Um. So so far I've got just under 700 bullets. What time is it? It's only it's not even midnight yet, and we're still going. So I've nearly gone through half of my 9mm ammo. And yes, I've sort of been, you know, spraying around and things like that, so it is what it is. But, like I said, I think I'm okay with everything. Let's just grab... Ooh, Forge Steel, thank you very much. And, come on, man. I just want to deal with you guys. The, the spiders, the spider zombies are going to be the more annoying of these, of the Horde run, because... They're hard to get, especially in situations like this, and you're not able to 
uh, shoot these guys down appropriately and they just keep smashing your hatches which is rather annoying. Look, were you able to get up from all, all of those dead bodies under you? And you too. There we go. Come on. There we go. Here comes another copper. Just want to deal with him before he sort of tries to make his way in. Oh, no, he, d he did make his way in. Ooh. Oh, there's, there's two of them. Oh, three of them. There we go. And young Edgar here is sort of trying to make his way in. He's trying to be a sneaky man, but now he's actually created a block and I can't actually get through and shoot these guys on the other side here. Come on. Just... I'm trying to... Hopefully, there he goes. Okay, he drops. Perfect. It's kind of hoping he'd either disappear or just fall over. So, anyway, either way, works out for me. Oop. Hello. Come on, Big Bertha. Ah, there's a nurse. Oh, there's there's a white. We have a we have whites. Hello. Let's just switch over to the M60 here. Oh, reload. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Now it's just randomly trying to break out. Okay. Is the white still alive? No, I don't think he is. Okay. Can see some birds, so that's fine. Should I go out and deal with them? I don't know if there's any... I don't know if there's like a lot of birds out here. There's two. Okay, well that, that's okay. Oh. Come on, guys. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Don't tell me that's it. That can't be... Oh no. Thank you. I was going to say, this would have been a much easier Horde Knight than my previous Horde Knight. Oh, level up. I've got three skill points. Awesome. Alright. I really need to find a scope for this thing. Or something that... Oh, here comes another white. And he... Um, any other birds that I can deal with while I'm here? Still got the buffer. I'm okay. Um, come on, guys. Perfect. And oh, ah, I this I knew that was gonna happen. Eventually, I knew that was gonna happen. All right. Oh, they got through. How far have I got to go? I, I still got a few. Like I said, I, you know what, to be honest, I think I might have to actually start thinking about um, running to the next four base. Just purely because of these things. What I need is I need a, um, I need a nail gun. That's what I need. That's, I think that's what I'm lacking here because even the, the hammer will do a job but won't do the job fast enough as what I would want it to be. So, yeah, there's that, but... Oop. Reload. So yeah, I think I might have to skip over. I'm just hopeful. I'm just hoping that even though that I'm out here, oh, here comes a birdie. Just hopefully these guys aren't sort of, you know, killing. Ooh, we've got a white. We've got a white. Uh, killing my supports. That's that's what I'm most worried about. Come on. Oh, reload. 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 Okay, these guys are okay. Like I said, I think this makes Horde Knights so much easier. Especially, like, you've just got these guys just funneling in and really that it's so controlled that I'm not too overly worried about this. And I guess this is like a really, really easy night for me. I, I'm really not at all worried or, you know, on edge or anything like that. So I think I am okay. Um, but it is 1am so far, so we've got another 3 hours of this game time before the horde actually finishes off. So usually these guys come pretty much until 4am. Well, that I've noticed, especially in the last whole night. I think we sort of got back, I don't know, about 3.30, quarter to 4, I think, in the morning before um, before the horde night sort of finished up and wrapped up for the evening. So I think that's 
where the likelihood of this would be as well so yeah and like I said I'm just I'm just sitting here every couple of times oh you come on and just sort of you know taking them out it's actually not a bad bad run of this and to be honest this is the safest I've ever felt during a horde night as well even though this is day you know day 28 horde oh good birdie take you out yeah like I said I, I want to try and get all the the birds looked after just so there's more hordes spawning in and we've got more zombies to play with I'm hoping there's a bit of loot, uh, loot bags around but we'll see um, so far, no irradiated zombies, but we do have um, we do have a white. We have there's probably about four, maybe five whites that I've seen. A ton of cops, and surprisingly, I haven't seen any dogs come through yet. Because sometimes they do pose a bit of a problem. They're able to sort of glitch themselves and jump over, and yeah, pretty much um, I have to deal with them, you know, almost immediately, and that sort of you know puts me back a little bit. But otherwise, so far it's so good. Let's just get, deal with the. The copper there, oop, it just bowls him over. This little skater punk here. Okay, let me just quickly... Can I get to that loot bag? No, I can't. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Just sort of trying to see if I can get to that loot bag at the very least and at least grab it, but I may have either missed my chance. Hopefully it hasn't despawned. I'd be really annoyed if it has. Okay, guys. That, that can't be it. Oh, here we go. There, there's the next the next wave here. You know what? I'm going to let these guys run back up um, back up there. And I might even just go over here and just deal with them that way. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. That, <laughs> that just freaked the hell out of me. I'm just thinking here, minding my own business. Yeah, you know what? This horde base will stand. I have no reservations about this um, being a problem. So let's just jump into here and let's use OG horde base. Let's get these guys coming over. Hey guys, glad you can make it. Okay, the party's over here now. No, nope. party house number one was, I don't know, a little bit too cramped, I think. And I think you guys will probably agree with me. So house number two why not Oop. and I'm more um, perceptible to actually being attacked as well at the same time and I think this is where I'm gonna actually use more ammo as opposed to the original horde base so I think that's probably the, the reason why that this was a little bit more of a fallover as opposed to um, the new horde base but from what I can see there it doesn't appear to be that um, that, that bad so it looks okay there's a few of you guys coming through. There's no one in there. Oh, hello. No one's dropped in yet. And I'm actually glad that now I've got a little bit more coverage up there too, so I don't have to worry about anyone jumping and running across the board base and dropping into there, because I had that problem last whole night. If you guys recall, if you guys actually seen it, um, definitely check it out. Hey guys. Look at all these guys. Coming to say hello, I'm ever so popular. Come on, Spidey. Come on. Ooh. You cheeky, cheeky lady. And I'm sort of starting to run out of um, rounds here. Actually, you know what? Uh, I'm going to have to... Okay. Alright. Let's just do some melee for now, I think it's probably good time until I get my weapons repaired of course. And look at that, the bat's doing work as well. Oh, hey guys. Look at that. The bat is ridiculous. I, I hear feet. I hear people. Ooh. Is that, how, do you, how, do you, how would you do against a white? Come on. Clock, uh, clocked him out of course. He's obviously going to come back up and, you know, try for a second helping. And 
Did I take him out? I don't know. I think I did. <laughs> Even with the baseball bat. Nice. Yeah. It's a really successful night. Ooh. Okay. Come on, guys. Yeah, I reckon I could just manage this with, with my baseball bat. My stamina is ridiculous at the moment. And I'm just, I'm actually going power attack on power attack as well. Yeah, alright. We're just cooking a zombie barbecue here at the moment. Ooh, look at that. And he's down. Get out of here. Ooh, comes another one. Unless that was the same one. I have no idea. No clue. Nice. Let's take you out. Tell you what, like I said, those spiders zombies really, really annoy me. Come on. But they're trying. They are trying. And they focus on that same pillar as they did in the previous Horde Night as well. Oop, I'm out of stamina. Um, Alright, let's eat. And let's just take a bit of a drink. And... Oop. Because they might break into that first pillar, which is fine. But let me just... Oh, they did. They did. Look at you guys. Look at you guys breaking down my stuff. Oop. Hey, Mr. White. Goodbye. Okay. Oop. Let's just clock you. Clock you. Clock you. Oop. Oh, look at this. Like I said, this bat is doing work. Super happy with this bat. Okay. Come on guys, simmer down. Nice. How cool that other loot bag is there? It is. Okay, cool. Hello. Oh. Okay, we are into the final hour of Fortnite, so we, we're getting there. We are getting there. Nearly done. Oh, you know what? Let's just continue to dismember these guys because as I can see they've actually broken through both of my first ports of the whoop of my um of my, uh, my poles here so and I just have to sort of amp it up a little bit and just get these guys to you know behave there we go oh Oh, hey, where did you come from? Just sneak up on me, why don't you? Okay. Oop. Reload. Okay. Let's just cut to the chase, guys. Oop. Oh, this reload is the worst. Looks so good as soon as I get... A, uh, sorry, as soon as I get back into it, I think I'm gonna have to find some mods for this as well, just so I can get some extended, extended rounds and everything else. Because I think sixty, I think it's like sixty rounds for this thing. Um, okay. Alright, so this is gonna break soon. Let's get you guys over here. Come on, guys. No, nah, okay. Oh, no, they're coming. They're coming. Hey, guys. Come through here. Oop. Are they still breaking over there? No, they're not. Okay, well, that's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Actually, what I wanted to do was sort of stand back here. So it's similar to like what I did last time. Um, in my last horde night, I was just sort of sitting here and just wa waiting for these guys to run down the corridor here. And just sort of, you know, just take them out as they come along. Because that is breaking down. 
I think they've only broken one hole over there. I think I'll, I'll have to check it out once it's all done, but I think we should be fine. Okay. There we go. Still hear those feet. I still hear them. Here we go. There we go. I don't see any more whites, which is rather disappointing. Haven't seen any uh, radiated zombies yet through Horde Knight, so a little bit disappointed on that, but I reckon come next Horde Knight, I'll probably get some um, radiated zombies. I don't I don't think I'm anywhere near, um, uh, what do you call it, demolishers or anything like that, so I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Oop. Ooh, jeez, you just sort of hopped and skipped in, didn't you? Okay, is there anyone else in there? Hello? Is that it? I think we're done. I don't think it, anyone is actually alive here. Um, let me just open up this real quickly, if I can... Thank you. Any birds? I don't think there's any birds. I think we're good. Alright. Just going to go ahead and reload just in case, of course. And um, let's see if there's any loot that we can get from this. Um, still fire axle, Ooh, machine gunner. Okay, what's this? Um, <clears throat> recall, tell my privates. Yeah, pinch, don't flinch. It's more accurate when shot when each shot. Okay, no worries. So let's go ahead and pick all of that up. There's a loot bag over here. And we have survived the night. Have a look at us. Okay, got some Casino Dukes for our troubles there, a little bit more ammo, which is always a nice thing. I'm hoping there's going to be some bags up in here, but let's see. Um, oh, there's nothing here. Okay, so yeah, look, they are broken through one, two, let's say about three of those hatches there, and they were onto the fourth one. So, you know what, like I said, I could have, honestly, I could have just kept within this whole base the whole night and had no, absolutely no problems whatsoever. Didn't even need the spikes at all, so I'm actually quite happy with that as well. So, not actually a bad run, to be honest with you. So, yeah, that's it. That's Horde Night. So, yeah, I think we're going to go ahead and leave it here. It's probably a good time to do so. So, I appreciate you guys stopping by, watching my videos as always. Be sure to comment down below. Let me know what you thought about this Horde Night here. Um, don't forget to hit the like button. If you guys are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos. All right, guys, take it easy and I shall catch you next time.